Uh, hello, Justine. Hello. And what is your position at the museum, Justine? Well, right now I'm a volunteer, actually. Uh -huh. but, uh, I was working with the museum throughout the summer with Youth Canada Works. All right. I was a Youth Canada Works employee. So that was a three-month contract, I think. Three months, two months. To walk in this way and turn to the left and then see the material from the 80s and the posters and then I'll have the art boards up here with more photographs and articles from that decade and then so you'll have to turn to the right and then come along this way and it's going to be the 90s over here so there's going to be a video of um, this production they did celebration. Hanging from the beams is going to be are going to be the set design drawings, so you can walk this way and take a look at them and look at the stage. Mm. Um, and costumes will be hanging on these left pieces. I have the scripts displayed too, so the bookcase of scripts, because there are just so many. Mm. On this wall is going to be a projection of the Monty Python skits that they did in 2002. Um, this is the costume that was on the poster, and then does up in the back with Velcro. Oh. It was worn by Ted Burden, I believe, in uh, the play Irma Bep. It was him and Brian Crumbly um, the cast of two, that there was, I believe, 52 costume changes throughout the play. Oh. <laughs> and so um, it was just easily accessible in the back. I think this is gorgeous. Yeah. yeah. Beautiful, hey? Mm. Brenda probably saw what I did on the post and offered to help. There's some beautiful dresses that were done. Wow. This is awesome from the same play. And it'll be fun because you can see um, there'll be photographs that I'm wearing in, in the production. Mm -hmm. So you can see them in the photographs and then see it right beside the PJ. It's awesome. And those in the back. What? This was from the Midsummer's Night Dream. I was in that. Were you? I was. <laughs> yeah, there you go. And, oh, made by Brenda Webster um, in 2010. And it says Mark Parks, you wore this one. I remember. Yes. It's gorgeous. Yeah, so here's the shirt that goes underneath. Um, it'll be hard to put this on a mannequin because it's not going to be <laughs> mannequins that are made for pants. So I'm going to most likely hang this one. Yeah. Um, believe it or not, these are pants. Pantaloons, <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> maybe. <laughs> yeah, You've got to be a big man to fill that. <laughs> <laughs>